Um, I don't know if you were of, uh, of that time. When I was at school, trainers were huge and in the sense that, you know, we all wanted the latest trainers and I was obsessed with having really cool trainers. Still kind of carries on now. I've got Is a it? bit of a trainer fetish, yeah. Um, look at this, though. Police were called to a three-day queue for a pair of trainers. 500 people were queuing on the streets for a new line of trainers. Um, police were called to keep order. Paramedics had to take a man who suffered a medical um, episode really? to hospital later. Um, social media kind of got the train launched. You're sighing, Charlie. You don't seem. Well, to no, I don't get this. For me, the best I mean, pair of trainers. Are they is still for sale? Well, obviously, someone's got them there. No, I mean, as in, as in. Yeah, the, the, well, this is the idea. You can just wait a couple of days and go when there's not a queue. I know, but that's a very sensible thing. But it's all about the power of um, retail, isn't it? It's the power of having the new, newest things and kind of. I doesn't do it, it for me, it doesn't. No, normally just I prefer an happens. old battered pair, really, with holes in. You well, know, they'd be not. comfortable, you've been wearing for years, yeah. and people keep telling you to get rid of them. Like, no, I no, can't, I because they're comfortable.